we introduced Rhymes, a system for easily authoring, recording, and reviewing interactive multimedia exercises embedded in lecture videos. Millions of learners watch videos online, but the video learning experience is pretty much one way. Normally, it's the teacher who does most of the talking and explaining, and the learner stays passive, confused, and bored in front of their computer. Some existing online education platforms provide multiple choice questions or simple lab activities inside videos, but what if we further enable students to submit richer and more interactive responses? We introduce Rhymes, a system that allows teachers to insert interactive exercises into video lessons and students to record their responses with video, audio, and drawing. Rhymes is developed as an extension to Office Mix, a free PowerPoint plugin that turns slides into an interactive video with instructors' audio or video. The Rhymes workflow includes three stages. First, the teacher authors a Rhymes exercise. The second, the student records his or her own response. And finally, the teacher or the student can review all students' responses using the gallery. Now, let's take a look at each of the steps in more detail. First, teachers can add Rhymes exercises inside PowerPoint, a tool many teachers use to create their teaching materials. Anywhere in the slides, teachers can add an interactive exercise by inserting a Rhymes object, and the author interface pops up. They can add instructional text, select a mode of recording, which can be any combination of drawing, audio, and video. The teacher can also embed a background image for students to work on top of. They can see a preview of what the student will see in the video player and modify the exercise. Once the exercise is good to go, they can publish the slides, including Rhymes exercises, as a video. Once the video including a Rhymes exercise gets published, Rhymes is now part of the video watching experience. As the student watches the video from their web browser, the video pauses when the Rhymes slide comes up. The action that he is performing subject and verb. Okay, very simple stuff. The student can hit record to start recording their response and use video, audio, and inking to give and explain their answer without any extra plugins or software. Once recording is over, the student answers how confident they are about the response and how helpful the exercise was in understanding the material in the video. When the student submits the response, the video automatically continues. As students submit their recordings, the gallery interface gets populated. The teacher can get an overview of all submissions in one screen. To get a more detailed view of the response, clicking on an item replays how a student recorded a response. This helps teachers understand the thought process of the student with a synchronized video, audio, and drawing playback. As the teacher reviews an item, all reviewed items are tracked by the system. The teacher can filter responses to see only reviewed or not reviewed items. Filtering by input mode is also supported, with each response showing the captured modes in small icons. Finally, sorting helps teachers decide which ones to look at first, as they can sort responses by added time, student name, and confidence and helpfulness rating. To see how Rhymes can be integrated into the existing lessons teachers give, we invited 19 teachers to the lab and asked them to create Rhymes exercises using PowerPoint and Office Mix. Examples included a physics exercise where students were asked to circle parts of a candle and explain physical properties of it, and a math one where students directly drew the answer on the chart. There was also an English exercise that asked students to use different colors to identify poetic themes, and a history exercise that asked to draw an imaginary world view of a person living in the Renaissance era. Students were able to successfully record their responses to various activities that teachers have created. Students commented that they enjoyed the higher interactivity of Rhymes exercises, which helped them become more actively engaged in the content. Teachers who reviewed the gallery of student responses appreciated the fact that they were able to get an overview of all submissions quickly with the gallery, capture students' thought processes, and easily identify misconceptions that students have. Teachers were excited about using Rhymes in their flipped classroom settings, and we expect Rhymes can be useful for other video learning scenarios as well.